My name is Daniel Houghton, and I direct the Middlebury College Animation Studio. And just this past year is when we began incorporating the HP scanning into our workflow. One of the biggest missing pieces is how do you go from the concept of a character into a three-dimensional digital character that can be animated in your short film. And the scanner filled in that gap. So the scanner bar's got two cameras on it, each pointing in at the object, which captures the object from two angles at the same time. And what that allows is for us, with a single scan, to capture an object with enough fidelity that we can be over and done with it. It provides a high resolution mesh of anything you put in front of it. And for us, that lets us throw a clay object down on the turntable and within an hour or so, get a workable 3D mesh that we can start putting into our animation projects. Finally, the student who started the process by sketching with pencil and paper can then look at this cleaned up mesh and reposition the vertices, giving it one final pass so that the character once again looks like the initial drawing that began the whole process. So when the students sit down with the 3D scanner for the first time, they are genuinely excited. They get to see something they made with their hands uh, come to life on the screen in a way that they never have before. Sculpting an object with your hands creates an idea in your mind of what that object is. And to see that exact same object appear on the screen in a virtual space for the very first time is magic. They've seen something they made in the real world exist in the virtual world in a way that they never could before. So with the arrival of the 3D scanner, finally we were able to uh, begin with art first and wrestle with technology second.